comic, Get Your Gains. Hey, welcome back all you gainers to the Gainer Nation. Uh, what did you say? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. Uh, if you're new to the show, uh, we are Comic Gains. I'm Adam. I'm Zach. And this is Her Royal Highness. The royalty is here. The Long live Her Majesty. The princess. The princess. So, um... Today, guys, we got a really cool show for you. It is Monday, so we're going to do a mystery box, open a, a mystery box, and we got some Monday Mania Gains, our last maybe ever Monday Mania box that we're ever going to open, hopefully not, and we have some of the princess's auction gains, some auction gains that she got from a friend of the show. So, um, yeah, what are we drinking? I'm drinking a Trulies Ooh, Watermelon going... and Kiwi. He's going light today, guys. I'm going the salsa route, guys. He's back on the Watch salsa. out. So, um, this box here, which we've opened a couple times already, and we have the monthly subscription, so we're just going to keep opening with you guys. This is box, box Heroes, which is a really cool box. Uh, we liked it so much, we, we ended up getting the subscription. It's $30 a month, um, plus shipping. Plus shipping. Plus yep. shipping. And if you get the subscription, then they just send you one, one every month and just charge your card. And then you get a bonus book if you are signed up for the subscription. So I think you get six books? Six books. And then start every month. Of If you bought, let's say, in September. Uh, next month is October. No, September. No, no. no. So if you buy in September, mm -hmm. then it's October. Right? Well, anyways, are you talking about the giveaway? I'm just... No, I'm not talking about the giveaway. Okay, okay. Too many beers. Here's more relevance. Okay? <laughs> so if you buy it in August... There's an extra giveaway in September, and I believe it's the first. So you gotta post your books on social media, Facebook. I thought I was being kind of clear. Sorry, left out. Yeah, there there is a chance to win some uh, slabs, yes. and basically like they do it on Facebook. I mean, it's Facebook, right? It's Facebook. Yeah. So you you post your books on Instagram after you open your box, and it enters you in to win um, some uh, books on Facebook. We we only kind of figured this out on the last one we did, and we ended up. Getting in for the show, we didn't win anything, but it was a pretty good, some pretty good books on there. They were given away, so yep. really cool. Yep. Um, they're really, really well packaged, and you get like mylar. Every book is mylar, so it's really, really cool. That's why we, we just like the box. You get some really cool old stuff that you haven't seen in, in forever. So if you guys like it, check it out. It doesn't break the bank. You know, thirty dollars. Oh, and Coco's dancing. So acceptable <laughs> ones are Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. You can post all your games on there, and I think you have to follow them, and then you have a chance to win extra stuff. Yes. All right. Do they actually show the card what you could possibly win, or is that on their website? I think it's on the website. One, two, three. I don't know what's going on. So it's on their website, guys. Okay. So check it out. So we got seven books. So you normally get six books, and then uh, with this one, with the extra one, the bonus one, you get seven. So, so from the bottom? I, no, just do the top. Or you can do from the bottom. Yeah. Looks like that one's got the writing on it. All right. Nice book. X-Men 202. Uh, classic Sentinel cover. That's a really cool cover. Yeah. Has Rogue. And one of my favorite characters, I believe, is in this book. Uh, she's only show, shows up, I don't know. I mean, her first appearance was in... X-Men 141, and then she doesn't show up again to like X-Men 180, 190. Who are you talking about? Oh, Rachel Summers. Oh, you gotta say the, the name. He's like, that one girl, that one time. I'm leading up to it, oh, and okay. then he interrupted me. Oh, okay. Now go. Okay. Now go. 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 Shank. All right, let's see. So That's a pretty good book, though, right? Wait, 80s book? Yeah, uh, 80s. 80s. Yes, 80s? it's 80s book. Okay. Not bad book. Ooh, I like this one. That's cool. Wait, does it have a... Uh, a Mark, Mark Jula? Jula? Maybe. So we got Fantastic Four number one seventy two. Let's see. Uh, you got the Destroyer on there fighting thing. I like the floating heads in the background. That's pretty cool. So a twenty five center book. Cry the what? Bedeviled planet. Bedeviled. I have Is that a real word. Of... Bedeviled. Yeah, bedeviled. Okay. The princess says it's a real word. That's a real word. That may I be her first word. She says. Bedeviled. Oh, she's hiding behind the book. <laughs> you bedeviled me. I'm bedeviled. Next book. What'd you get? Box Heroes, Where Monsters Dwell. Ooh. This is cool. Is that first print of Grog? Grog is here. It's probably a reprint. Is it? Well, it's a reprint of the first Grog. You I'm think sure. so? Not 100%, but 
Oh, Kirby down. It's a Kirby cover. It's cool. It's a really cool cover. There's it's actually a couple cover. good Where the Monsters Dwell books, right? Sorry. Go look at that. Look at that real quick. He can't hold. Where? Which one? See if it's a Mark Jeweler? I didn't see a Mark Jeweler. No. Mar Remember, guys, if you get. Um, what? It's like 70s, right? It's like 70s uh, Marvel books or not always Marvel books? Uh, I think they also do maybe DC. But it has to I've be. I've never seen it's one. It's got to be DC. newsstand. So always check yes. to see if you got Mark Jeweler, Mark Jeweler uh, inserts in there. Yeah, what you want to do is you have the book in front of you, face for it, just angle it this way. If you see like a black line, not the crease, but like a black line, looks like it's insert or something, that's a Mark Jeweler. And if it's a newsstand, get those games. I'll do mine. That's I think I. Yeah. That's a lot of money. I have way more than I think they're going to blow up. I'm going to do that one. Oh, you just ruined it. No, this one's different. That's right. There's something weird going okay. on. Okay. So, you got Star Wars 35. I wonder... I'm on a double no, check. No, it's number 14. No. Um, sorry. It's a 35 center. Oh, okay. This could be a price variant. Because uh, that's always... It's not a Mark Jeweler. <laughs> now, we're, we're going to look and see every book is a Mark Jeweler. Wow. Chewbacca looks savage. <laughs> <laughs> cool cover, though. He's a savage. It's a great cover. It's a good, is that that's not the original printing? No, that's original. That's the original. That's printing? original. That's cool. The Marvel Comics. Marvel was the first one that did it. Star Wars. Yeah, for sure. It's for not sure. that not that long ago okay. from uh, when they first uh, made the movie. So this one for some reason has a comic on the front and the back. So you got Raiders of the Lost Ark number one, which is really cool. You got Harrison Ford on there, and then they got Raiders of the Lost Ark number three. I think there's a third book in there. Someone was specking on Raiders. There's, there's of the... another book inside there, which I'm guessing it's probably Raiders of the number Lost two. Ark number two. Someone so, was specking on that's this. That's cool. Dude. And it's a Marvel book, too. That so, actually I mean, might be a really big hit. That's really cool. So you got a little run. So if you wanted to read Raiders of the Lost Ark. So which how is, many... Which is cool. If you guys didn't know, the first Indiana Jones movie is not actually called Indiana Jones. It's called Raiders, which is... I think they like later renamed it Indiana Jones. So did we get nine books? Oh, yeah, I guess that's a bonus. That's kind of cool. Yes. Okay, that's books. how you get those games. All right. My last book. <laughs> we got that one in a different one, right? It's The one we got was in a virgin. This one's... Was a virgin. Yeah. 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 This one's not a virgin. Yeah, trade dress. It's a great cover. It has some writing on the back, though, right? It's an art term. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, it's very good. Very good. <clears throat> It'll match our virgin variant. Very well. Nice, nice. It's supposed to, that's based on a video game, right? Horizon Zero. Yeah, isn't it? It's kind of cool. Made, good yeah, it's supposed to be a really good video game. So this is our subscriber bonus book um, for being to get, for being a subscriber. You get the extra book, like you said. Oh, that is really cool. That is art germ. Yeah, Dark Knight Death Metal Three with Supergirl in the uh, art germ. That's a really cool book. Mm -hmm. Nice lady cover. I don't, we don't have Respect. that one, right? Respect, no. Oh, going to the princess. Oh, she's of claiming course. our bonus book. What about our bonuses? I think that Raiders of the Lost Ark is actually worth a lot of money. Yeah, so. it could be. It could I be for sure. So again, I mean, another box. really good, really good box from Box Heroes, guys. If you guys haven't checked them out already, check them out. They're cool. We we'll, get some. We'll link it down below. Yeah, definitely. So, if you're getting into comics, click. it's a really good way to start out. Maybe you might find something that you really like. And just to be clear. These clicks don't give us any money. We just love these boxes, and we want you to get those games. So get them, game. Get those. Games. Okay, so this is our last uh, Monday Mania box. Do you want to explain how Monday Mania works, or did work since you can't really do it anymore? Unless it, unless it comes back. Hopefully, it comes back. Uh, JP seems pretty excited about it. So it's every Monday at 2 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, and exactly 2 p.m. or so, he released X amount of books, probably like 30 books. First twenty, you get a chance. You get extra books on top of that, and then every book after that, including the twenty, you get a chance to win extra books. Every book, or he has probably like a hundred books that he's gonna give away. So every chance, it's, if you get in earlier, you have a better chance of getting, winning more books. I'm not being very clear, but anyways, you can win more books if you buy at least three books. Your whole entire Ooh. order is cut in half in price. Anti Venom Venom Club. You pay a hundred, you're paying fifty, and it's free shipping. But you have to get at least three books. Three orders, yeah. Three, yes. yeah, three books. Yeah, he's right. So if oh. it ever comes up again, guys, jump on it because it's cool. Especially, you, 
the first couple ones you won, we won like a ton of free books. What's that? It's... Uh, let's see. Okay. Oh, that's interesting. Look at that. Let me see if I can organize it a little bit. Not. Looking, I think we got a that Spider-Man booth. I think we got a that Spider-Man booth box in there too. This okay. was this was in there. What the heck? Yeah, we'll open that one too. So okay, cool. So we got. I don't know. I don't know how we. We never ordered one, so I don't know how we just got one buy. I don't we'll understand. See, we'll see how okay. I get those games. So first book, it's a thick book. It's yes, Flash Seven Fifty. We don't have that one. The Emerald City <laughs> one. We We're gonna build a house out of those, dude. Yeah, yeah, they're they're great. I it's think... a good book though. We've actually sold a couple. I think it'll come back. I really like the cover. Boss Talk is just great art. Yeah. So you can't go wrong. You can't go wrong there. Okay, not a thick book, so. Ooh. Venom 10. Venom number 10. That's a second appearance of Dylan Brock. Is it? Oh, yeah, Venom 9 is a really big one. Yeah, if you guys see, we found Venom 9 out in the wild on a back rack. Cover. So, yeah, mm -hmm. cover price, so. I like that Venom 10. It's cool. I kind of almost just want to read that whole story. Yeah. It should be hard to get your hands on number 3. I, th I just think you... I just think you just gotta buy the collected series. Yeah. Like 10 issues. The Omnibus or whatever. Yeah. Exactly. So, this is going to be a hot book. I can't believe they actually added this into it. I think I bought it. Actually. You bought That's it. why. Uh, Ma the Magic Order, number one. Apparently, this has a really good story. I'm excited to read it. Oh, it's an image, too. It's a really pretty, really pretty cover, too. I like that cover on that one. It's fire. It's on fire. fire. I don't know what that is. <laughs> kind of makes me think of Deadly Class. No. Uh, it actually makes me think of The Magicians. Ooh. Whoa. Dude, I think that's Agents of App. Dude, I don't think that's a $15 book. I don't think so either. Who is that? I think that's Agents of Atlas number one. Whoa, that's sick cover. That's Agents of Atlas number one, Is guys? that Arrow? No, it's a different character. I can't remember, but I think that's... That's a fire cover. I don't right? think that's a fifteen dollar book. Well, sometimes I, you buy. We bought this like I don't know three months ago, so a lot of some of these books have gone up in value. Oh my god! Oh, oh, he's getting excited. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. It could be like the regular ish the series, but that's a great book. I want that. Oh, oh that one's cool. Who did the art on princess. that? Wow, I don't know. Like, it's really good. Well, classic Wolverine. Uh, on on a motorcycle. motorcycle, you can't go wrong. With the claws coming out, like Captain America and Wolverine on a motorcycle, you can't get any. You better. can't go wrong. I think the Punisher drove a motorcycle too, right? Or did he have a van? He had a van. He had a van. <laughs> you, you two get a motorcycle, Punisher. We're gonna punch you with a van. You get a van. Oh, that's cool. Fur lining. That's cool. X Men number seven variant. Is that, is that a face simile? Homage. homage. It's, homage, it's homage, homage of uh, Uncanny X Men 141 Days of Future Past. Yeah. It's a cool cover. Great cover. Great cover. I didn't even see any of these before. A lot of times when we're on the, doing the buying them on Monday Mania, Zach's over on his computer buying them real quick. I don't he's get swearing to see the whole time. Yeah, he swears a lot when he's doing it. We don't have that one either. So cool. Whoa. Look at this. And then, his, I think that's his daughter. Shredder's daughter? Karai? Karai? There's so many. Like Teen Mutant Ninja Shredder and Hell covers. Oh, I love I think that. I've cover. seen like two or three different, or three or four different covers already. Is there a number two? I don't know. Maybe I've never seen a, a number two. I've never seen a number two. Maybe we'll see it in the spot. I've never seen a number two. Oh, you buy another one of these? Yeah, this it one's looks nice. like it's in good condition. Yeah, this really one's, good. This one's a really good shape. So, second appearance of Deadpool. You got X Force number two. So, guys, That's cool cover. Well, people don't realize is I think this is the first kind of like X Factor, not X Factor, excuse me. X Force? First um, Weapon X project, kind of like when it's mentioned. This could be a very expensive book. Not too expensive, probably like maybe a 9.8. Medium 300, expensive. 300 to 500 hours, but has lots of potential. All right, my last book. Ooh, that's a good one. So this is a Captain Marvel number eight. Car oh no, Venomized. Carnageide, right? No. Oh, is it Venom or Carnage? I don't know. It's red. Maybe. No, there's black. Oh, there okay. No, yeah. I don't know. I know. It's Venom, it's Carnage, who knows. That book is going to dry up where you're going to... It's going to dry up where you can find it regularly. 
and that book's gonna go up in price. It's a good cover. It's a, it's a yeah, fact. It's a, it's it's a, a fantastic cover. cover. It's a fact. Guys. So we got another one here. I guess we'll just it's do the first appearance. Of I don't know why this one's numbered, but was yours numbered too? No. This one's numbered. What's it say? Sixty nine. Ha! <laughs> Our favorite. What the heck? We're keeping that. Then we can't so, get rid of that. Is that the exact same cover? It's the exact same. Hey, cover. You can just show them the number though. That's funny. What's Why would we get? The only one whose numbers is 69. <laughs> we got oh. that print that was numbered 69. That's weird. Very strange. Very strange. Did you only say it like if it's like signed or anything? Ooh, oh, yeah. You bought this one? Yeah. That's funny. First Iron Spider. First, it's nice. That's a nice cover, too. First Iron Spider. I like all those ones from that era where they did all the shiny spider webs in the background. There's like five or six books that are like that. Pretty That's cool. That's one of the good ones yeah. right there. First Iron Spider. Okay, so for some reason there seems to be, I think, a mystery box in here. I'm not sure what the deal is with that, but we'll we'll crack this open too. Maybe it's just more stuff we bought, or maybe it's a mystery box. I don't know. You wanna go first? Okay. Under. Okay. Actually, let me do this. All right. So you got yeah, Runaways number three. This is just a throw-in. There's nothing specific with it. Runaways. But it's a direct edition, so that's kind of nice. I'm your little runaway. Wait, what? The wait, what? What's a band called? The Runaways? Well, that's the other one, yeah. Yeah. Okay, what do we got here? <laughs> <laughs> well, we got another one. That's funny. That's funny. And the black eyes. At least we didn't have the one before. All right, next one. Okay. I like X-23. Yeah. I think we have this. I've never seen that one before. Pretty cool. That's cool. a lot of characters going on. Yeah, a lot of characters on there, but at least mm -hmm. she's like big and centered in the middle. X-23. X you can't go wrong with X-23. Really, really cool character. I think it's undervalued right now, guys. So, it's really expensive right now. The first appearance? But I yeah. think it's going to be even more expensive. It'll so. get hot. Yeah. Hotter. Hotter than hot. Oh, that's kind of cool. It's got to be mm -hmm. Cosmic Ghost Rider, right? You got Thanos. Ooh, that's a fallen one. Oh, and then, yeah, the black, uh, Silver Surfer Black. That must be a Silver Surfer issue. You sure it's not Cosmic Ghost Rider? Could be. If you guys know, leave down in the comments. I but think the hot ones are like 14 and 15 right now. For Silver Surfer Black or? Uh, for a Cosmic Ghost Rider. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Yeah, this is the first appearance of something. Dark Knight Death Metal 2? Yeah. I think that was the good one, right? Dark Knight Death Metal 2? Yeah. Okay, so, too. so it seems like we got a mystery box in there. I'm not sure how that happened, but it's a happy accident. We're okay with getting a mystery box. I'm not sure if we paid. We might have paid for it. Probably did. Um, okay, so this last one we're opening is some auction games that the princess got from another YouTuber, Gorilla Todd. And really, really cool guy. Um, a lot of times you can find them on Metaphoricals auctions, which are quite often. They're like, it could be any, any random day, I think. But um, he has a lot of good stuff, and oh, he sent us peanuts. The peanuts. Oh no, oh no, peanuts. But uh, you clean all that up. How else was I supposed to open that? He's oh, okay. But this should be uh, a slab, I think, right? Oh jeez. Let's see. It's a slab. Zach, don't get hungry for the peanuts. No, I don't. You don't like them? Adam does. Yeah, hungry enough. He loves them by loads. Some of them are edible, I think. You wouldn't say that. <laughs> you like try one, you're like, nope, this one wasn't edible. <laughs> this one was not. This was just the foam. <laughs> <laughs> I am mattress. <laughs> if you guys know don't what I'm talking start about. That. If you guys know what I'm talking about, comment down below. No, don't even... <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh my. Let's see. That's ridiculous. Let's see, get some tape games. At least I have a sharp knife to get into this. Good God. I feel like I'm opening Pandora's box oh, here. Oh, princess. Who's, who's, whose personal collection is this going into? You guys fighting over this one? Uh, it's going, I think it's going into mine temporarily. It's not yours yet. But this is a book that I bought uh, but the prince, I gave the princess permission to buy it from me for the same price. Permission? I mean, it's kind of like, no, well, <laughs> I gave her the okay. Let's say that. <laughs> I gave her the okay to buy it for the same price. Because it's just such a fire cover. It's this original sketch. 
Uh, I think it's a CGC 9.8 or... Well, 9. we'll wait till 4. we get into it. Yeah. But there's some raw books in here, too. Gotta have a little bit of mystery, because I don't even know what it what? is. There's raw books in there? Yeah. Princess hoodwinked you. You what paid for some I raw buy? books, too. What else did I buy here? <laughs> But yeah, guys, if you haven't if you haven't checked out Metaphorical's auction, check it out. They got some, they sell some good stuff on there. It's metaphorical. Yeah. Right. Okay. Let's see here. Okay. Do you want to do the raw books? Yeah. Oh man. He Everything's it, taped. He packed it up pretty well. That's pretty good, Gorilla Todd. Gorilla Todd. Gorilla Todd. Gorilla Grodd is a character from the DC Universe. Okay. Enemy of the Flash. Yeah, well, we can't see it anyway, so. Right, let's see. Here you go, Zach. Flip these over. Oh. Oh, jeez. Okay. All right, you going first? Okay. From the bottom? Everyone said they liked our longer videos, so. All right. Oh, she's eating not right. That's a bloody steak. That's Vampirilla, sure. right? I don't know. She, she's she's got those bloody moves. That's cool. Hot of my heart, glad of my blood. All right, next. Okay, looks like uh, the trade the trade dress <laughs> version. Okay. Vengeance of Vampirilla number five. There you go. In case you guys want to know what cover that was. The princess always buys the virgin cover and then the now trade dress too. Know. She needs two copies of everything. So In case she wears out the first one. Next book. <laughs> what? It's a difference. <laughs> What's a difference? Did you buy two of the same book? It's the same one. <laughs> Is this an accident? Wait, that one she's got a little more blood on. No, it it's is exactly the, the same thing. <laughs> She'll tell us later. It's... <laughs> if you can see the difference. Oops. Maybe it has one little mass port, uh, swirl. She needs to read them. Okay. I swear to God, that's a trade paper bag. Ooh, that's a oh, hot cover. Okay. I Who like drew it. that one? Uh, I can get down with that cover. It almost looks like Archer, but I don't think it is. Oh. Could it be? Oh, she's busty. <laughs> <laughs> what the? What's that? You leave Vampirilla alone. Oh. You leave her alone, Zach. She's mad. All right, ooh, I like that. That's fun. With the skeleton in the background. Man, yeah, she's, trying, nice. she's trying to get a bone. You're gonna get hit. Is that like an homage bone. to that Batman cover? The Harley Quinn? <laughs> like a bad one. <laughs> Those homages, like if you do it right, it looks so amazing. Okay, last you one. You can't get better than Alcross. That was random. Right? This is a cool book, though. It's a cool book. Yeah. But so you got Shadow Cat with uh, Lockheed on there. Vampirilla, 90%. And then, or I guess it would be, uh, I guess it would be 80%. Are you really trying to figure out the percentages, right? Well, there's four, <laughs> well, there's four Vampirilla books and one Shadow Cat book, this is so cool. 80%. This is really cool. So this is the main reason you guys got it? So you got... Secret Wars number one, Marvel Comics. Uh, this is signed and sketched by Al Milgram. Cool. Black Cat action on there. I think Al Milgram actually was the person that did the original art for Black Cat. Really? At least that sounds of. right. That does sound right. I believe so. And he offered this at 150. Well, Zach, it's it's only a 9.2. It's original art. It doesn't matter. Yeah. So, just say. Would you say that? Yeah, if it's original art, it doesn't really matter what the grade is on it. Yeah, I don't think it really matters. As long as the book isn't destroyed, you're just looking for visual. You're looking for the art that makes me feel something. If the book is at least in presentable condition, if it has original art on it, it's fine. It's worth the same as 9.8, or it should be. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. So, um, that's the video we got for you today, guys. I think we found some really cool gains. Some really awesome stuff that's going to go on our PC. So as usual, guys, if you like our show, love our show, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. Don't eat those peanuts, Coco. And you guys, you guys don't eat those peanuts either. Um, hit the notification bell. And uh, anything extra anybody should be doing, Zach? Well, first you have to have your your uh, 
father as a police commissioner. Or no, maybe not a police commissioner. I think he's part of the police. And then you decide, <laughs> I don't know which one I'm going to go for. Like Felicia Hardy, which I think her father was a police officer. And she gets like some... No, her dad was a cat burglar. No. Felicia Hardy? I think in the comics, uh, her father was a police... Anyways, let's go the other way. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. The spire. You become Sp- Spire Gwen. You fling around all over the place. And you get those games. Done. Let's do it. That works. That Let's works. Go. Get yourself a nice little. Pink, I need to get some coffee pink, guys. Tight costume. I and get Zach, some coffee. Zach will wear a Spider Gwen costume coming up soon. No, it could happen. No, that's it, that's for the princess. Spider, the princess can handle and not handle, but she can pull off a Spider Gwen outfit better than I can. <laughs> and uh, I only say that once in my life. That only once. All right, guys. Everybody, stay safe out there. Get those games. We'll see you guys later. <laughs> coffee.